Many individuals fear death. But the thought of reaching the end of their life and realizing they never truly live is what truly frightens them. An extensive hospital study was conducted on 100 elderly patients who were near death and asked to contemplate their life's greatest regret. Surprisingly, the vast majority of them admitted that they regretted not taking risks or pursuing their dreams. They wished they had done more instead of looking back and thinking about the things that didn't do. Therefore, it is essential to ask yourself whether your final words will be, if only I had. Listen, wake up. Have you ever thought about why you're here? Life is not meant to be just spent working, waiting for the weekend, and paying bills. I might not know a lot, but one thing is for sure. Every single person on this planet has a unique talent. And I'm sorry to the black community, but I can't pretend anymore. Martin Luther King didn't choose his dream. His dream chose him. That's how it is with dreams. They chose you. So my question for you is this. Do you have the courage to take hold of the dream that has chosen you? Will you allow it to guide and empower you? Or will you let it slip away? I recently had an enlightening conversation with a pilot who shared a surprising fact about airplanes. Many people believe that flying is risky, but according to the pilot, it's actually more hazardous for our plane to remain on the ground. The reason is that when a plane isn't flying, it begins to corrode, break down, and wear out at a faster rate than it would if it were up in the air. I found this revelation fascinating because airplanes were designed to soar just as every individual was born to pursue their dreams. Living a life without taking risks or chasing your aspirations can be the greatest tragedy of all. Listen, fear is not the thief that sneaks into your house to rob you of your possessions. There's much worse thief in your mind. His name is Dao. Don't take him lightly, he's a dangerous criminal who's responsible for killing more dreams than failure ever could. Doubt comes in many forms and can infect your thoughts like a virus, leaving you uncertain and hesitant. Kinda is his favorite word and he uses it to create an army of kind of people who only half-heartedly pursue their goals. If he wants something badly enough, don't settle for kinda wanting it. The results you get will only be as strong as your commitment to achieving them. What sets your soul on fire? What is the dream that drives you forward? It cannot be just a passing fancy. It must be something that you want with every fiber of your being. The path to success will not be easy. You will stumble and fall countless times. You will face challenges and obstacles that seem insurmountable. But keep in mind that there is no such thing as an easy climb. The road to the top is filled with steep cliffs that must be scaled. You will experience stress and there will be moments of despair, but always remember that even the most successful people have faced their own share of setbacks. Steven Spielberg was rejected three times from film school. Oprah was fired by television executives who doubted her abilities. Beyonce was once told she couldn't sing. Struggle and criticism are part and parcel of the journey to greatness. No one can avoid it, as it is a universal law. Life inherently involves pain, but the kind of pain you experience is up to you. You can either endure the pain that comes with working towards success, or suffer the pain of constantly regretting missed opportunities. My advice to you is simple. Don't hesitate. Life is a precious gift that we've been given, so it's essential not to waste it. Your past does not define you, rather you have the opportunity to start a new one every moment, so take ownership of your present. There are moments in life when taking a risk is necessary, even if it means you have to figure things out as you go along. It's important to act quickly because time is limited and opportunities don't last forever. There are no second chances in life and I may come across as preaching or speaking strongly but it's crucial that you utilize your talents. Failing to do so will not only affect you, but also the world at large. Consider what innovative idea, cure, or skill is hidden in your mind that you can bring forth into this world. The universe is like a grand symphony with each person having a unique role to play. Don't be afraid to take the stage of life. 
Grab the microphone and sing your heart out with boldness and courage. You may not have the opportunity to completely start over from scratch, but you can choose to begin anew at this moment and create a fresh outcome for yourself. The audience was quiet for a moment as if contemplating the weight of the speaker's words. Then a woman in the front row raised her hand. I hear what you're saying, but it's not always that simple, she said. I have responsibilities, bills to pay, and obligations that prevent me from pursuing my dreams. How can I just start over and make a new ending? The speaker nodded, acknowledging the woman's concerns. I understand that life can be complicated, and there are often obstacles in your way. But I want you to ask yourself, are these things truly preventing you from living the life you want, or are they just excuses? He paused, allowing his words to sink in. It's easy to fall into the trap of making excuses and playing it safe. But remember, we only have one shot at this life. Are you going to waste it, or are you going to take a chance and pursue your dreams? The audience was silent again, each person lost in their own thoughts. Then, a man in the back row stood up. I've been playing it safe for my whole life, he said. But hearing you speak has made me realize that I don't want to live with regrets. I want to take a chance and pursue my passion. The speaker smiled, a sense of satisfaction washing over him. That's what I like to hear. You don't have to quit your job or uproot your entire life to start pursuing your dreams. Start small. Take baby steps and see where it takes you. You might be surprised at what you're capable of. The audience began to buzz with excitement, each person feeling inspired and energized. The speaker continued, sharing stories of individuals who had taken risks and succeeded, despite the odds. As the event came to a close, the audience erupted in a standing ovation, clapping and cheering for the speaker. People lined up to shake his hand and thank him for his words of wisdom. As the speaker walked out of the building, he couldn't help but feel a sense of fulfillment. He knew that he made a difference in the lives of those who had come to hear him speak. And that was all he could ever ask for. But he also knew that there were millions of people out there who were still living with regrets and unfulfilled dreams. And so he vowed to continue spreading his message to inspire and motivate as many people as possible. To take a chance and live the life they truly wanted. For him, there was no greater purpose than that.